How's it going everyone? JKXVX here, back on Foot 2004 once again. Today's video is sort of a follow-up video to the video I did a few days ago regarding what stage Forza Motorsports are at. Now this gives us a lot of information at where Forza Horizon 5 is at as well. Now it's been a few months since we've done a Forza Horizon 5 video, it's time for another one. There's a little bit more information and more opinions and guesses that we can make about what's going to be in this game and when it's coming. Let's get into it. Now you may you may have heard that Forza Motorsport 2021 or the next Forza Motorsport is now in a playtest stage, meaning the game is now playable but in an extremely early stage, very very early. You know, it's not a beta, it's not an alpha. Now we are in April of 2021 and usually these games release around, you know, September, October, November time, which isn't that long away. You know, we've got April, May, June, July, August. September that's six months if that less than six months until we supposedly get a next game now it's obvious and it's I would say is a hundred percent certain that Forza Horizon 5 or the next Forza Horizon is being made as we speak whether it's scheduled to release this year or next year we don't know yet it's something we may know soon but we don't know now all of this Forza Motorsport information now leads us to believe that are we getting Forza Horizon 5 this year instead just because Forza Motorsport seems a long time away? Well, we don't know. If we're going to have a Forza Horizon 5 this year, we are probably going to hear it or have it revealed within the next couple months. It's probably very soon. There's only six ish months left until whatever game we are supposedly getting this year releases. Forza Horizon 3 and Forza Horizon 4 were both revealed for the first time on June the 10th around there which is only two months away. The chances are when you're watching this video it's less than two months away. So there's a very good chance that within 60 days from when this video is released we're going to hear something about a Forza Horizon 5 if we're getting one. There's absolutely no confirmation if we are getting one or not, but if we are, it's very close to being revealed. And if we don't hear anything by then, the chances are we may not receive Horizon 5 this year, as has been talked about recently. Are we going to get Forza Motorsport instead? Well, that depends if it can be developed quick enough in time from its current playtest stage. But unfortunately, this brings up the question now, are we actually getting any Forza this year? sure do hope so you know we have no idea what stage the Forza Motorsport is at in terms of development but it still looks extremely early and we also don't know about Forza Horizon as well we've not heard anything on that at all um, but that was the same with Horizon 4 we didn't hear about it it was revealed and then it got re released the same year as scheduled now is it going to happen with Horizon 5 we'll have to see we don't know we really don't know yet However, with how long it's been since a previous Forza Horizon title, it's been it's been years since we've had one, the last being Horizon 4. Now this has given Playground Games, the people who developed Forza Horizon, a ton more time to develop this game. You know, they can take their time with it and go slowly, just like Forza Motorsport has. Now, is Forza Horizon 5 going to be such a big game changer like Forza Motorsport is? I think it's going to be. You know, they've had years of extra time. They have the Xbox Series X console to develop the game for. There is a lot more possibilities for the next game than there were in Horizon 4. Now, there was something interesting I came across on Twitter thanks to Alan Walsh, or Beetlecomus, as you know him. He was, the, he was the person I saw this tweet come up and thought, that was very interesting, that. I wonder, I wonder what we can take from that. Now, this is the tweet here. Basically, he found something, I presume it was him that found it. He found an article 12 years ago, back in March 2009, when they were talking about Forza Motorsport 3. Now, in this article, there was a certain paragraph. Let me read you the, the paragraph in question now. My focus has been solely on our future project. This is presumably talking about Motorsport 3, by the way making sure that we deliver on our aspirations for what we think are some pretty awesome community features and ways for those who love cars and speedboats slash helicopters to interact with each other. 
Secrecy being what it is, now is obviously not the time to divulge such details. Besides, when we do announce our next game and show you what it looks like, it'll be done with a bang. Now this tells us that it was, by the looks of it, in discussions um, many, many years ago for Forza to contain not just cars, but speedboats, um, you know, helicopters and stuff like that, just like the crew. I had to think what the game was then, the crew. Now it's obvious that games like this are possible because the crew has done it rather well. Now the question is why haven't we gotten anything like this in the 12 years that they've been developing games? Is it because they've not had the tech for it? Is it because there's not been enough interest? We'll have to see. However, since the crew being a thing, I think Forza now know that there is an interest for games like that, where it's not just cars, but other stuff as well, other vehicle classes. Now this opens the discussion of, are they gonna ever go through with this? Has the Xbox Series X technology given Playground Games enough tech to make a game like this? That's not just cars, but everything you can imagine. This is just pure speculation, this is just pure discussion, but it's something that could be considered with how much extra time Playgrounds have had to make this Forza Horizon title, Forza Horizon 5. They've had so much extra time to make this. They're working with the Xbox Series X, obviously, or the Xbox Series S, you know, that kind of technology. There is a lot of possibilities that can be done. Is Forza Horizon 5 going to be a game changer to the point where there are extra vehicle classes. That's going to be very cool to find out. Now, while we're on the topic of Forza Horizon 5, there is something I need to address, and that's the location. The location of the game is something that people go on about loads. We want Japan, to put it short. Everyone wants Japan. And it was a while ago now, but I'd say a few weeks ago, there was a map leaked for the game Forza Horizon 5 and it got quite a lot of people excited because it was a map of well a japan map i really just want to say don't believe this map there is absolutely no confirmation that this game is going to be japan there's been a, a little hint or two sort of spoken about but there's been nothing confirmed and this map is absolutely fake if you look close enough it's just come on it's so bad the roads and the lines are just jotted on the map with no correlation to what's actually on the map with the mountains. So as for where Forza Horizon 5 would be, we still don't know that. Um, I just really need to say don't believe any of the leaks that have been going around lately as for this map being real. It's not. I like to do these discussion videos every few months is because, you know, we're getting very, very close to the, the portion of the year where we would hear about a potential new game. At the moment, one of three things is going to happen. We're going to get Forza Motorsport, we're going to get Forza Horizon 5, or we're going to get nothing until next year. And at the moment, with how everything is, I don't think any of them are more likely than the other. I think all of them are just as likely. Which one's it going to be? We'll have to wait and see. What do you think Forza Horizon 5 is going to be like? Do you think they're going to be making the most of the tech that they have access to and how far they can go with the game and how good they can make it? Do you think they're going to make the most of the extra time they've had? We'll have to wait and see. Anyway guys, this has just been another update video as it's been a few months. Give it another couple months and we may finally have some information. Leave a like if you've enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already for more Forza Horizon 4 content. I'll see you all later.